We are Onyx Imaging. We are the highest rated and most reviewed printer service center in Oklahoma. Hey there YouTubers, it's your girl Brett over here at Onyx. Today I'm going to show you the common causes of a paper jam and I'm working with an HP Color LaserJet M281. <clears throat> so it's pretty simple. Um, these are some simple tips and tricks you can do to prevent paper jams. <clears throat> Here you have these blue adjustments. You want to make sure this is in the correct size for any labels, envelopes, um, different size paper that you're using or multimedia. Um, <clears throat> this one, you want to adjust to the size of paper that you're using as well. So just make sure those are in the correct spot for the size that you're using. And then right here you have these max level indicators. You don't want to fill over these or too close to these. Um, if there's too much paper in there, it's going to be too hard for the printer to pick it up. And then if there's too little, then it's going to be hard to pick up the paper as well. So just make sure those are correct. Anytime you are adding paper to your tray, you never just want to take your new paper and just stick it in there. A lot of times it's not aligned and it could cause a jam. <clears throat> so if you take your old paper, mix it with your new paper, and fan it out. A lot of times um, I like to do this because we live in Oklahoma so there's a lot of condensation or humidity in the air sometimes. So fan it out and then align it all together and stick it in your tray. If you guys are seeing lots of paper jams it's probably time to put your printer in for a service. If you're in need of any supplies or quotes give your girl Brett a call and have a great day. Thank you for watching. If you're interested in how you can receive free labor on all of your service calls, as well as how to qualify for free printer upgrades, contact us today. We are here for all of your printer and office supply needs.